friends, welcome back to another video. Today, I'm gonna be working on the guest room. I'm standing in here right now, so I'm gonna show you some before shots. Um, and then Sean's gonna be building the bed. I got some items off of Facebook Marketplace, and then I'm gonna reuse some of our decor from the last house. So I'm not exactly sure what it's gonna look like when we're done, but we'll just see as we go along. But I just wanted to show you guys the view from this window because it's so pretty and everyone has been commenting on how pretty the mountains are here. And I 1000% agree, they're so pretty. So here's the view from the guest bedroom. Sad day, cause they are building. <laughs> it makes me like kind of sad to see them out here building. Cause I'm like, no, they're gonna have like a building, you know, in front blocking, but we will enjoy this for as long as we have it. So first things first, we wanted to pull everything out of the boxes that the bed came in. And that's the first project that we did. I had Sean work on this for me. He is very handy and super mechanical. So I feel like he can put things together so much easier than I can. So it gave him a little bit of grief, but for the most part, he got it all put together and we absolutely loved the way it turned out. Also, if you're interested in anything from this video, I have almost everything linked down in the description box. Okay, so here's the bed all made. Um, took Sean a little bit longer than it probably would have. He said that there were some issues with like the screws and stuff like that. So anyways, but I really love how the bed turned out. I think it's really gorgeous. So now that we have the bed all put together, I wanted to get the nightstand and prop them up like where I wanted them to be. And so that is what I'm going to do right now. So I was really excited because we got our mattress sent to our door by Lull. And we have had Lull on our mattress in our master bedroom for quite some time now. And I love, love, love their products. They have super comfy mattresses and I love that they come in a box. It's so easy. It just gets delivered to your door. You just pull it in. And this is us just kind of like the process of us getting it and putting it inside the room and it came with a couple of boxes. They sent me some extras and I will show you those in just a couple minutes. So I just had a box cutter and I was cutting open the box. And once I get that all opened up, I'm just gonna be pulling out the mattress and everything that's inside of it. And then I'm going to set up the mattress on my bed. So I was so happy that we didn't have to like drive into town rent a truck, put a mattress back there, and then bring it out to where we live, and then take the truck back and turn it back in. It was just like a thousand times easier just to get a mattress in a box. So as you can see, Sean is just pulling it out of the box, and I'm gonna just go ahead and put the box out in the hallway, and we're just gonna be getting it set up here on the bed. So I took that same little razor, and I'm just cutting off the outside layer of it and it's super easy to get this thing set up if i can do it anyone can do it so once i switched over to the other side it was a little bit easier to um, kind of slice that open with my razor and as you can see the mattress is starting to expand i had accidentally cut into the second layer of the plastic wrap but it doesn't really matter you can just see it's totally starting to expand like as soon as it gets like a hole punctured into it it starts to expand and then it opens up and it starts to get thicker so you'll see that as the video goes on now like i said earlier we have been using lol mattress in our master bedroom for many years now it's super comfortable to sleep on it's like firm but it's also soft i don't know how to explain it perfectly but it is really comfortable and we just absolutely love it also i wanted to mention that lol has free shipping and has a 100 night trial and free returns. So if you're interested in checking out LOL, their information is all linked down in the description box for you to check out for yourself. 
So Lowell had also sent me this bed cover. So I wanted to go ahead and put that on first. So we're gonna get to doing that. So now I'm just going to be grabbing a set of sheets that are actually from the bed that Sean and I had when we had a queen size bed. So these are not brand new, but I figured like it doesn't really matter because we won't have a ton of guests and the guests that we have will be family. And so I feel like they'll understand <laughs> they're washed and they're clean and all that stuff. But so I just went ahead and put the sheets on and then I grabbed this Tahari home quilt that we had gotten from home goods i believe and so i was just going to unwrap that and get that put on the bed So next I had purchased a couple pillows from Target and they're just like a standard bed pillow. And so um, the comforter came with some, I think these are called shams. And so I just put those on the pillows that we had bought and I really liked the way that they looked. So now I'm just going to be getting our throw pillows, our throw blanket, and just unwrapping them with the packaging. And we got all this stuff from Home Goods and TJ Maxx. So I don't think I can really link these um, pillows, but uh, we loved them. We feel like it looks like a really fresh, bright look. And so if you have like a Home Goods or TJ Maxx near you, you could always go and check out the store if you like any of the things that we used. I just really can't get away from whites and grays and tans. It's just kind of like my personality. I just like the neutrals. It's funny that the, the little um, rectangular throw pillow has some color in it because I swear most of my rooms do not have color in them. So I just opened this box from Lowell. Kind of forgot that there was another box that came with it and they sent pillows. How nice is that? I'm like, that is so cool. In other news, I just went downstairs and got myself some more coffee. Sorry about my lipstick, but look how cute this mug is. My friend sent it to me from Oregon as like a housewarming present. Isn't that so sweet? Um, Cause I love the show friends. So moment of truth. I really don't like the color of these side tables at all. When we saw them on Facebook marketplace, I swear they were tan, but once I get them in here, I realize they look green and that does not go with my vibe in here at all. I think I'm gonna paint them gray. Let me know down in the comments if you think gray or what do you think for, or do you think I should leave them alone or do you think I should paint them gray? So now I'm just unboxing a couple of lamps that we bought. I believe we bought these from Wayfair, but again, I'll have everything linked down in the description box. But for some reason, these lamps came with an explosion of styrofoam and it was a disaster. I'll show you in just a second, a close up of it, but if you can see it right now. Okay, so in a second, I'm gonna replace those pillows or I'm gonna replace those pillows with those pillows because I think that these low ones are way nicer. So I'll do that in a second, but oh my gosh, look at me. I am literally covered in this styrofoam. It is like sticking 
to everything. I don't even know, is it coming across in the camera? Like, look at the box. It looked like something exploded. <laughs> So I wanted to invite you, if you are new here, to make sure and consider hitting that red subscribe button, followed by the bell for notifications. I would love to have you as part of the subscriber community that we have over here. I'm super excited about the content that's coming up and that I've been putting out. So make sure you binge watch some of my moving videos. We're doing lots of makeover videos right now. So if you're into that kind of thing, then I'm your girl. So I'm gonna go ahead and switch out the pillows right now for the Target ones and the Lowell ones. Um, I just feel like these are a little bit nicer quality, so I wanted to put these in the shams. Okay, so now I just have this box of decor that I'm gonna kinda go through and pick some stuff out to see if I can find something that goes in here. So it's been super fun just kind of like going through all of our decor from the last condo and just picking things out for different rooms that didn't used to go in those rooms. So I don't know, I just thought it was really fun to kind of reuse some of our old pieces and definitely save some money as well. So if you're decorating a new space, it's always fun to get new stuff, but it's also nice to reuse some old pieces as well. So now I'm just gonna head in and try to vacuum up all of that styrofoam. Those little pieces were everywhere, including all over me and my legs but um, we just went ahead and got it all cleaned up. You can see Hudson having his little debut <laughs> with his iPad. He is such a sweetheart and has been doing so good in the new house. I've just been really happy with him and how he's like adjusting and all that stuff. So um, anyways, I am just gonna be vacuuming with our new Dyson. That is also linked down in the description box. felt like the room was kind of missing something once I was done vacuuming so we went ahead and went to Hobby Lobby and now this is a different day and we went ahead and hung up a guest sign which I am in love with we got it for a discount at Hobby Lobby I believe it was $30 or 30 something and I just love the way it turned out it brought the whole room together and it totally makes it look like welcoming and friendly and warm and I just like love 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 this sign So we've never had a guest room. Obviously, if you've been with me for a while, you know <laughs> like our living situation in our last condo. We were so cramped, so it's really, really fun for us to have a space to set up for family and friends to come visit and we can be like hospitable 
instead of having people sleep on our couch. It's just so nice to have this room. So let me know down in the comments what you thought. Don't forget to subscribe and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys. Most.